A local resident is told to take down his undead version of the nativity scene in Sycamore Township. Not on your sides, Tony Moronis tells us the display does not meet the requirements set by the township and the owner didn't file for a permit to build it. The nativity scene in question is tucked away in Sycamore Township between Deer Park and Blue Ash on Voorhees Road. Drivers stopped and stared. I think it's all in kind of a good natured thing. With the baby Jesus and the narrative behind that. But. They come to see what the owner says is the first of its kind in the world. I wanted a zombie scene, yeah. a manger scene, and uh, all I had to work with since I managed 13 rooms at Doom Haunted House is uh, zombies. It's a different take. I handmade everything but Joseph and baby Jesus, so it's kind of artsy. Spooky, creepy, zombies. The undead nativity sets on wooden skids. It stands about eight feet tall with a roof, hay, and lights. It's complete with everything except one thing. Uh, it's missing, I guess, a permit to build a structure in your front yard. The Sycamore Township regulation reads that any structure should be three feet from any property line and six feet away from any structure and should be in the backyard. But this one is in the front yard. You know, as long as it's applied to all nativity scenes in Sycamore, I think that's fine. My God, th th they're just offended. Because it's a zombie nativity scene, that's why. The township says it's all about the zoning code and nothing more. And Jason says he'll do what zoning wants him to do. After Christmas, I'm going to take it down because it's a holiday set and I'll take it down. If you're just driving by, it looks like a nativity scene. If you're the government, the structure is a violation. Tony Moronis, 9 on your side, Sycamore Township.